Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello and welcome. My name is Katie. This is a, ooh, excuse me, a clothing haul video and it's from Shein. I know some people are a bit dubious to try Shein because of what else has come out in the media and stuff. Um, but like I said, as a disclaimer, I support Shein because I obviously it helps people stay off the streets with work I know the conditions aren't the best but I feel it's like Primark Primark probably doesn't have the best conditions for people working wise and if I can help in any way by keeping people who are in them places off the streets and just working then I feel it's it's the right thing to do um, and I think some of the clothes in that it's quite on, bar, on par with Primark quality wise so yeah I have a big order from Shein there's a big pile here <laughs> I've taken it out of the bag and I've just got it all in the little bags so let's get cracking with Shein haul I'm going to say this one's a bit of a more witchy themed Shein haul clothes wise um, there's a little there's a couple of like home bits, there's some makeup in here as well because um, I need to try and sort my eyebrows out and I haven't got any like eye pencils or anything and I saw they had something there so I thought I'd give them a go. So I hope you enjoyed the video and let's get cracking with this sheen haul. It's not going to be in any particular order because the bags are just in one big massive pile. I do love the fact that sheen put their um, bits in these bags because they're easy to if you want to go on holiday, when you go on holiday, you can put them in there to like keep dirty washing or swimming stuff or something like that. So, um, first of all, I did buy a couple of t-shirts. So I'm going to have to do a little bit of a declutter in my t-shirt drawer. Um, so this one's just like a plain black t-shirt, but it says, we, me, weird, always. And that is me. <laughs> so it's just a plain black t-shirt. Um feels quite stretchy um i will have try on clips in the video um i don't know if i'll put them alongside me or um in separately after i've shown everything but um yeah so it's just an oversized t-shirt i did get it in a 1xl so it's going to be quite fairly long um so yeah just a basic t-shirt with a quote on um <laughs> i'm gonna have to put it here <laughs> actually put it in the bag so that's t-shirt number one there is quite a few t-shirts in here so next um i have this t-shirt i do have the print of this t-shirt already but i did just get this one in the, just the oversized long t-shirt to maybe wear a t-shirt with t-shirts <laughs> maybe to wear with cycling shorts or leggings so it's very very long um, and it's just got one of these bookish prints on. So I love that. And it's just in a dark green. So yeah, I thought that'd be nice to wear just over like, like I said, cycling shorts or leggings. Oh, this one doesn't have a label. I'm sure I got it in like a 1X or 0X. Got a label? Oh, I got it in a 2X. <laughs> Maybe I just wanted it extra long. Um, so yeah dark green with this lovely bookish um, print on so that is t-shirt number two um, what's next trying to find something else that's not a t-shirt oh this so this is probably for October because it's more of a spooky item <laughs> Um, and I saw this and I thought this would be so cool to wear because, um, yeah, it's just spooky and it looked cosy as well. Um, and it's a cardigan. So I probably will save this to wear in October. So it's just this black cardigan with ghosts on. <laughs> and it's actually really soft. It's not like itchy. It looks might look like the itchy material but it's not it's actually really really soft so i'm looking forward to wearing that in october um and it's quite a good price actually um if i can find the prices on my um order i will because obviously i spent a, i did do mine on clear pay but um 
I spent a chunk, obviously, to pay it off on clear pay, and I got discounted prices on my things. So, yeah, I got this in a 1XL, um, and yeah, this is going to look so cool. <laughs> So yeah, I got a little, um, I don't usually wear these kind of cardigans, but I just thought it would be really cool to wear in October, and I love the ghosts, <laughs> I think they're so cool, so yeah, I got a nice spooky cardigan for October, you might think I'm already mad picking up stuff for October, but things like that, on it's like Primark, if you see something in Primark and you don't get it and then you want it again, it will just go. So I picked that up while I saw it had a good price. Um, so yeah, what's this? Next. Oh, we've got these. Um, these are some shorts I thought for the summer. So just some plain denim shorts. They are stretchy and I have tried these on already, but I will try them on with the top. Um, and yeah they're slightly high-waisted which i wanted and they are a little bit snug at the moment but i will get into them because they're stretchy and i got these what does it say i wouldn't have got them in less than like a 1x i think i got them in a zero xl um so yeah some nice denim shorts so that back um i'll go to a couple of like homeware bits now so this is very weird <laughs> but i bought this book and it's one of these kind of witchy things called a book of answers it does have um some of it on in chinese um on the front but some of it is it is in english it's got chinese translation so the idea of this is you'd ask it a question open it on a page and that would give you the answer so i don't know um, will I have a good day today? And I've got the answer, don't overdo it. So that's what the inside of the book looks like. So that's literally the idea of the book, just to ask, ask questions like yes or no answers. Um, and it just you just open it on a page that you feel and that's the answer you get. So that's my little witchy book of answers. Um, Next, I bought a decoration. Um, this is going to go away for Halloween because it's kind of witchy, spooky um, decoration ornament. Um, it's. I think I'm going to. I might get try and get another one of these or a different one. But it's this little decorative ornament of this really cute cat like a witchy cat <laughs> so you can see a little face you can see her face um yeah it's got the the pentagram star on it so she's got a little witchy hat on um and yeah i think it's quite a good size it's i think it's all right decent like all right quality as well um i think this was about three to five pound i think but um like this i would definitely keep it for like forever um and it's just a little decorative ornament i thought would go either on my bookshelves um and yeah i just thought it was really cute i was just trying to see what kind of decorative stuff they had ready for spooky season because again like primark once you see it and if it goes it goes so yeah, I thought that was quite good for the price and it's come all packaged up and came all pack packaged safely. So that was that. Um, let's move on to another bit over here. So this is a little crop top. Um, some of my parcels came like in separate things so the blue denim shorts and this crop top came together and the other clothing came separately um some other bits came in a separate package as well um so i bought this little black crop top maybe to go with the shorts it's got um 
adjustable straps on it so I did briefly try this on as well but I'll try it on properly with other items um, so yeah again I thought summer wise something like this with the shorts cycling shorts um, would be nice and comfy and again it's got the kind of sun on it so kind of witchy feel and yeah so I thought that was really very really nice I got this in size large which is I think 14 child 14 um, so it might be a little bit snug on the top area but um, like I said it's just going to be a little crop top to wear like at home in the garden um, so yeah that is that um, I got some tote bags <laughs> very random I know I've got this one which is just a brownie colour and it says book club on it books on um, quite all right size probably a bit smaller but if you're just doing a little bit of light shopping like book shopping for example <laughs> then um, it's perfect size big uh, long straps as well so it won't be too like low um, so yeah I thought that was a nice little tote bag next I got some socks <laughs> and again going along with the witchy feel they are like moon and stars so this was a multi-pack and you get five different colours so you get blue blue and silver um, like a mustard yellow and white you get pink uh, pink and white and white with silver and yellow and just plain black with silver and yellow because i just thought i need some more like ankle type socks <laughs> um, and i thought that was quite a good price for the mods pack so i got those uh, next i'll show you this t-shirt this is another like bookish themed t-shirt um again very soft and I've got this in an XL so I just probably wanted a bit more of a baggy feel so it's kind of just this uh, what do you call it tan beige colour and it's just got this book print on it says book time and I just thought it was a simple kind of more of a simple t-shirt um, again got lots of stretch in it and I just thought I haven't really got many like light coloured t-shirts <laughs> so yeah another t-shirt to add to the collection I'll go with these two I'll go with this one first so this is something that is very very different to me I've been thinking about changing up my style and maybe wearing, I don't know, I just wanted to be a bit, show a bit more personality with my clothes. So I did buy a skirt and it's this kind of tartan skirt. It looks quite short, but I don't think it will be once I put it on. It might be like above the knee. Um, so I thought this is one of the witchy tops um, would be nice. It's um, I got it in a size large, which is 14, I think, um, and it's got lots of stretch in it, so it should be fine. Um, I just thought of maybe just not wearing jeans all the time. Um, obviously, when it's a bit warmer, <laughs> trying that out with one of the witchy or bookish t shirts. So I've got that. Next is another top. Um, and it's just a plain stripy top 
I think this is one of a cropped t-shirt. So again, with like shorts or again with jeans, but um, I just wanted a bit more of a little cropped feel. So I'm actually feeling a bit better about wearing cropped t-shirts now. So I've got this in a 1XL because I didn't want it to be too cropped just yet. <laughs> um, so I thought that would be nice, just a simple striped t-shirt. Um, yeah, so just a bit more of a simple t-shirt because quite a lot of my t-shirts have just prints on or slogans. Um, so yeah, I've got that. Next, oh, I put some of the makeup in here. So I'll show that quickly. I got, I can't remember if I got multiples of things or not. Let's get all this out. So that's that. I think I've got two different types of eyebrow pencil in here. So I've got their makeup is called She Glam. So this one is Brows on Demand Two in One Brow Pencil. I've got that one. I also got the She Glam Expert Eyebrow Gel. I think that's to help keep the, if you put like tint on, help keep it on. So I've got that. I got the She Glam <clears throat> Feather Better Liquid Eyebrow Pencil. That a go. And lastly, oh, I got the concealer, Like Magic 12 Hour Full Coverage Concealer. Because I don't wear a lot of makeup, so um, I thought I'd try the concealer. And they were the bits of makeup that I got, I think. <laughs> uh, I did put all the small bits in this bag. Um, what else did I get? Oh, I got this belt because I thought with the skirt I could put this around the waist um, and I thought it would help cinch it in. So how does this go? Like, like that and like that. So that would be how it would look clipped together. I thought it would just be a nice little addition. I used to wear stuff like this quite a lot when I was younger. <laughs> um, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, that and what else is in this bag? Got some shorts. Oh, and some patches because I wanted to add some patches to my denim jacket. <laughs> I've still got some patches, but I just wanted some like witchy ones to add. So I've got this moon to add these are like iron on as well so if you didn't want to sew them on you could iron them on i've got this like butterfly moth um i've got these tarot looking ones which are the sun and the moon um which are very very good nice so we've got the moon Now we've got the sun. These were all like really good price, like one one to two pound. Um and I also got these uh stay weird patches as well. <laughs> so they're just some patches to add to my denim jacket. There's literally only a couple of clothing items and one non clothing item left and these. So these, I'm really hoping will fit or at least be a bit snug. If they're snug, then I know I can slim down into them because obviously I want to wear these this in the summer. So these are again witchy themed. They're black denim shorts with this beautiful moon, sun and stars design on them. So that's what drew me in. Uh, this camera's going a bit wild because of darkness. But yeah, that's the design of them. They're just plain 
black on the back and just got the ripped bottoms. Um, I'm hoping I'll be able to get them on. There's not much stretch in these. Like, I did get them in a size XL, um, so fingers crossed for me, but I will give you my honest opinion. Um, but I really, really love these. Um, I got a hope they fit. Last, um, I'll go through these t-shirts and then we've got one last non, um, like, non clothing item. The last few things are all tops, I think. <laughs> I went a bit wild on the tops. So this one again, it's not a colour I usually wear, but I thought it would be nice. So it's just like a moon colour, I think, with this lovely moon design on which I thought was absolutely stunning. Again, size XL, but it's quite a little bit baggy. So yeah, I've got that t-shirt. Next, it's another green t-shirt <laughs> um, and another witchy theme. I said I have a lot of witchy theme t-shirts. So another green one, but it's just got this lovely moon design going down it. So it's got little crescent moons, the sun, and then just finishing us off the pattern just there. So that is that. Again, I got it in XL. Yeah, XL again. Um, so yeah, another green t shirt. Um, the last um, clothing item is this. I think this is another like oversized top. Um, yeah, slightly oversized. So it's grey and it's got um, like a tarot print on it and it's the moon. The bottom of it. So pretty. And then if I just quickly show you the top half. Absolutely something. So yeah, another oversized t-shirt with cycling shorts or leggings and i got this one in a large because i thought it looked oversized on the picture so it'd be like quite not quite all right size wise i think um so yeah that is my last t-shirt <laughs> and the last thing of this haul is another tote bag but when you see this tote bag you will instantly say that is you. <laughs> so it's just a grey, not grey, um, like hessian type bag, but it has a tarot print on it, which says books on it, and it says the reader. I instantly was like, oh my god, that's like me in a tote bag. <laughs> so again, it's quite an alright size long straps and it's quite nice on the shoulder but yeah I instantly saw this bag and was like oh my god that is me I need to take that one if I go book shopping <laughs> so yeah that is the second tote bag so that was everything in the haul from Shein I think now if I haven't showing you the try on clips i think i'm going to put them on next so i'll show you the various t-shirts on with either shorts um one will be with a skirt um and if i haven't got anything else to try them on with it'll just be like my jeggings or something just so you can see what they look like on so yeah that was quite a lot from sheen um and i'm really impressed with the quality like all the t-shirts were like really soft um got stretch in them I'm just worried about them black denim shorts. I really hope they fit. <laughs> um, and like things like the little cap decoration, um, are like little unusual bits that you find on Shein just when you're like scrolling. So yeah, I've already got a couple of bits like in my wish list on Shein for October for spooky season because I am really like wanting to do a bit more decoration for spooky season um yeah so there's already lots of bits of bobs on there and i'll probably buy some bits closer to the time anyway 
So yeah, what I'll do next is show you the bits on and um, give you my honest opinion. Hi guys, so before I try stuff on this, the next day as you'll see in this, but um, try the clothes on. So this is one of the t-shirts from Shein. Um, it is obviously, I think, a slightly little bit see-through, but I am wearing like a dark coloured bra, so that's that. These shorts, by the way, I picked up in a charity shop today. <laughs> um, so yeah, I thought I'd just try it on with those, because I wanted to try shorts on as well. Um, yeah, so I am very happy with this top. It just be like a just cheap, uh, uh, quick chuck on top. Um, so yeah, very happy with it. It's super comfy. And as I said, it was, I think it is meant to be a crop top, but because I got it in a bigger size, it was slightly more longer stretchy wise. Um, yeah, that is top number one. So here's top number two. It was just the basic me weird always t-shirt it's very stretchy so I could tuck it in like this um, with shorts jeans or anything like that um, yeah really soft really stretchy it's just a basic print on it and yeah it's just a basic t-shirt it's as I said really really soft um, it is slightly oversized um, when you get it down it's quite long um, so yeah just another basic t-shirt um, and I'm very pleased. I'm, I like that the sleeves come down slightly a bit as well. So, um, yeah, so that is my me um, weird t shirt. Next is the grey t shirt, um, the moon pattern. Um, really, really love this design. It's not as long as I thought, it only just, just comes down to the bum. But I think it's because I got it in a large, so 12 to 14. Still got room in it. Um, yeah, I just paired it with some cycling shorts just to see how long it was. So it was something nice to wear with jeans and um, just like this, basically. <laughs> um, so yeah, again, really soft t-shirts. The design is printed on really well. And yeah. A very really nice grey as well. I don't have many grey tops, but um, yeah. So that is the moon top. So next is this big oversized t-shirt. Literally, the model was around it literally like this with cycling shorts. Um, but this is massive, really, really oversized. So I didn't need to go up to two X. But um, yeah, it's really, really long. Um, and yeah, lots of room in it. So this would literally be one to just chuck on if I'm feeling hot, <laughs> um, to throw over maybe like if I've been out in the garden in a swimming costume or just like this, if I'm going out somewhere. Um, but yeah, it's absolutely huge for a 2X. So you could size down even two sizes if you didn't want it too big, um, lots of room love the colour though and I love this print because I've already got it on the t-shirt um, so yeah didn't really need to size up but it would be nice just to have, have an extra long t-shirt to throw over something in the summer and so yeah so next is the shorts um, blue denim shorts and the crop top I'll start with the crop top first, I've obviously got the wrong bra on, so um, you can see that, but um, you can adjust the straps as well, so if you wanted it maybe slightly longer, um, or further down, then that's all good. Um, yeah, I'm really, really pleased with this, I love the design, just need to remember to wear the crap bra. Um, and as for the shorts, the shorts are okay, they have got stretch, um, obviously they're a little bit snug at the moment, but I will make that a bit more comfortable. <laughs> um, I think they're a nice length as well. So not too high to ride up the bum. Um, so yeah, this was the outfit idea that I had for this. So um, yeah, it's just getting used to seeing me in crop tops, I think. But um, yeah, I love this design and I do love the shorts because they are stretchy, even though they've got button details. Um, so yeah, really, really love these. 
you are both uh, very, very comfy. So this is the next t-shirt. This was the moon design with on it, the kind of movie colour. Um, I've just got it untucked um, with the shorts. Yeah, again, I can't complain about these tops. Really, really nice, soft. Um, obviously, where I've got the shorts, my muffin tops, obviously showing a bit, but um, yeah, I'm really, really happy with these tops. All good, all soft, all fit really well. Um, yeah, so I'm really, really happy with all these tops and I would highly recommend. Okay, so I should have all like kept one of the darker tops to try over the skirt, I think. However, top, love it, really, really nice. Love this design, love the colour. However, I'm not sure if I can pull off this skirt. Um, it's got lovely stretch. It's really nice, really soft. It is, I don't know if you can see how short it is. It's like quite, well, for me as a 31 year old, <laughs> it does feel a little bit short, but I have got it how I would have it. Um, length is fine at the front. This is the belt that I got with it, which I thought I could do. I don't know if it's the fact that my body shape is already different to how I used to be. Um, however, let me know your thoughts, just be kind. <laughs> um, yeah, maybe better with a black top, but um, yeah, this was the kind of vibe that I was going for with this skirt. Um, so yeah, let me know what you think. It looks a bit blue in the camera, but it's like the tartan print. Um, obviously, you can see a little bit of my mum tom, but um, I think that's okay. I just need to get used to wearing this kind of style again because I haven't worn skirts in a very long time. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think. It's nice quality though. Um, but yeah. Last but not least, this top, which is slightly see through, but so so soft and I would not wear this bar underneath this top obviously but I'm so gutted about these shorts I've hoisted them up they won't go up they were so close but um unfortunately these shorts are a no-go at the moment which I'm really really sad about um they do feel really nice however they don't do up and I did get them in size bigger so I think with actual denim I would size up even more because they have no stripes whatsoever. So it's a no from the shorts, I'm afraid, which I'm really upset about. Um, and love the top. This won't wear this bar. <laughs> and the final thing of this haul, I've just chucked on my jeggings I actually got in my last haul, which are a little bit see through, so I don't really wear them out. Um, I just wear them from my lounge and that at home. But um, I've literally just chucked on my spooky cardigan just so you can see how what the length is and what it looks like on. I probably literally wear it like this, like I'm done. So this is so, so soft. It's not itchy or anything like, you know, like these typical cardigans are usually itchy. But um, yeah, I don't usually wear this kind of short length cardigan, but um, I think it goes really nicely. <laughs> So I would definitely be living in this in the spooky season because I absolutely love it. If they come out with any more, then I may have a look. <laughs> but um, yeah, the ghosts are so cute. <laughs> Obviously, there's no pockets or anything. It's just a generic card cardigan. It's got, I think it's four buttons. So if you want to do that up, you can. Um, but yeah, it's a nice length. And it's like, I think it's like balloon sleeves. Nice length on the sleeves. Um, and yeah, I absolutely love this cardigan. I want some more. <laughs> so I'll definitely be keeping an eye out because I think this is really good quality. It's really, really soft and I absolutely love it. <laughs> so that is the last part of the try on. So that was everything tried on from my massive sheen haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, as I said, I did try, if I did have the prices, I would put them at the bottom of the screen. Um, and yeah, so everything I loved, I'm just gutted about them little black shorts, but I will try and return them. Um, if not, 
may even donate them to a charity shop if I can't slim into them or um, yeah so um, that's that really so I hope you enjoyed the video if you did please don't forget to leave a big thumbs up if you're brand new to my channel hello and welcome please hit that subscribe button as I'm trying my hardest to get to a thousand subscribers and I would love for you to stick around so take care and I'll speak to you very soon in the next one bye Thank you.